Hey guys, what's going on? It's Cal Freezy here, and uh, yeah, I'm bringing you FIFA. I promise FIFA, I deliver FIFA. So uh, yeah, first things first, this is my FIFA Ultimate Team. This is my, uh, what do you call it? This is my Silver Team, Silver 5 Star Skills, Elite Skills Team. And um, yeah, so this is. I'm going to briefly talk about each player, to just talk about Silver in general. And uh, yeah, so why did I go for silver? Because uh, I don't know, just uh, there were a lot of five-star skilled silver players that I wanted to use, and um, I don't know, it was just a fun idea in general. I got the I got the main like who was really good because I had no idea who was good and stuff. So I got out mainly from R9 Rai. His link will be in the description. So will Josh's link and he does he's probably my favorite FIFA commentator so if you haven't if you don't know of him or you you're a FIFA guy and you just uh and you just start you don't know anyone you YouTube who does FIFA well uh, check him out and uh, check both of them out in fact and uh, yeah so let's get to it uh, I've, I started off with this uh, 4 2 3 1 formation purely because the, the best players that I the, the players that I knew that were really good they all fitted this sort of formation so uh yeah, uh, one thing I want to say is you you might be like, you have 100 chemistry, but for example, I have a Jobson playing center forward, uh, like he's playing striker, but he's a center forward, and I have, um, what do you call it, Fabricio in uh, center mid, but he's meant to be center defensive, but uh, basically, if you look, I, the, the little grids represent the formation, um, and what, what their preferred formation is, and so I've got his to my formation, which is 4-2-3-1 just over there there's a lot of information you might not be able to see but um if you if you buy formation cards and you do that then you should be on your way because you'll find um you'll find if you do that then it bumps it up a ton and i also especially with the manager make sure he has the same formation as what you're running so uh yeah so let's get to it at the front we have jobson i'm gonna go over this quite quickly quite briefly because there's not really that much uh jobson a uh, really good finisher, plays well, uh, I, I really like his style, there's not really much to say for him because he, he just plays out front and he scores the goal. Now this is the third time someone has called and I refuse to pick that up. So yeah, someone else can fucking pick it up, that's a joke. Anyways, uh, then right, so that's him, he's, uh, he's pretty good. Um, then we have one of my favourite players on the pitch, goes by the name uh, Giovanni. He's amazing at long range, I think he's got the flair trait, I don't, don't like, uh, bank on it but I'm pretty sure he does and he's five star skills most of these guys here are I'll tell you which guys aren't but um yeah so that's awesome he's awesome at free kicks if you're gonna have a silver team you gotta have this guy he usually goes for about 44k though so you gotta watch out because uh, he is quite an expensive silver player and silver players are quite expensive these days so uh, just watch out uh, and I actually saw him go for 401k coins which is just ridiculous but anyways Moving on, center attacking mid, we have Marlos, one of my favorite players on, uh, on in this entire game. Probably he's gotten past so many um, goal players. He's just a monster, and uh, yeah, he's just I, d I don't know. He's just a really really good player. He seems to just be able to just tear up entire uh, goal teams when I play them. Uh, moving right along to the other side, we have Danilio and Guns. You spam me with one more fucking invite, I'll kill you. Um, anyways, we have Danilio. I don't know. He's like 5'3". He's tiny. He's fast, but I don't know. I don't have him. I usually swap him in for my uh, Inform Hulk, and I usually keep gold gold guys on the benches in case I'm struggling. I'll just pull some gold guys on. But uh, yeah, so uh, he, he's all right. Um, he, he's there. He's five star skills as well. But uh, these two center defensive midfields, they neither of them have five star skills. I think they're both four star. Fabricio has got a shot and a half on him. I don't know why he's got a 71 shot, but he has got an absolute shot on him. Um, and uh, Richarlison, he's he's good as well. He just both of them play really well together. So uh, you definitely want them as your centre defensive midfields. They're about 10k each. I'm not entirely sure. You could probably get them for cheaper than that though. Um, back here, this guy's just big and he looks like a fud. So he'll do. He's just there to fill the spot really. Left back, amazing left back, really. He's five star skills for a left back as well, which is awesome. He's fast, and uh, you always want your left and right back the backs to be quick and fast and on their toes. Um, this guy, probably the best silver centre back. He's really fast. He's an 84 for a centre back. That's extremely fast, and he always catches up to the players. So you want to have him there. Um, he's quality, top lad. I love you, Mr. Manuel. Um, also, we got this guy with a really crappy hairdo. Um, he plays right back once again five-star skill not as fast as uh, 
Mr. Marcio Azevedo, or however you say his name. But uh, yeah, he's really he's really good as well. Both of them five star skills at the back, which is just awesome. Then I cheat in this team by having a gold keeper, Julio Cesar, which is just an awesome name. But um yeah, so he's playing at the back there just because if you have a silver keeper, you're just gonna let in a ton of goals and it really gets frustrating. And uh, yeah, so I mentioned the chemistry. You really want to have a hundred chemistry for a Brazilian five star skills team. It's so important that they pick each other out, and you can just. I just play with this team constantly. Um, there's another team that I have, um, but uh, I'm building them up at the moment. They're the 83. It's a La Liga team, and uh, I'll show you the go those them next time if you guys like what uh, this video is all about. Um, if you want me to do that one, I'm ha more than happy to do so. Uh, yeah, like I said, the bench, I keep some, uh, what do you call it, I keep some goldies on here. Uh, Inform Halt, probably the best Inform player there is. Uh, he's just an absolute monster. His free kicks are just out of this world. He's a he's a complete beast. So if you're gonna have an informed player, get informed Hulk. He goes for about seventy thousand, seventy, eighty thousand. So you should be able to get him pretty well. This is all uh, Xbox, by the way. I'm not too sure about PS3 prices. I heard they're a bit more. But uh, yeah, then we have Luis Fabiano. I had him informed. Great guy informed. I just uh, didn't feel it justified a hundred thousand for him. But uh, yeah, guys, that'll pretty much wrap it up for um, this Ultimate Team roundup of my silver squad and uh, or silver stars which is extremely camp but uh yeah that'll do i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this fifa if you enjoy fifa feel free to subscribe if you uh, enjoy my stuff um and i'll be sure to look your test um i'll be sure to uh, reply to all your comments and stuff in the description in the comments section if you have any questions about it so yeah guys don't forget to leave a rating a comment whether you like this or not but i expect to see more fifa stuff from me and uh, yeah guys have a good day and uh, peace out.